Hello world, I'm Brancliff. So I'm here at the character menu because I started something without realizing it and it doesn't seem I can go back on it. I am on the finale of Tatara Tales and I decided that I was going to record this because in the Patreon launch I heard that this was really hard and uh, I, I heard that there was like, you know, it, it, it was kind of like one of those like defend missions. Like there will be a monument and you press F in it and then the enemies spawn and then you have to kill them before they break the thing. I wasn't expecting it to start when I talked to the guy, so we're already in the fight. And um, I was meaning to switch to my B team before this, but it caught me off guard. I'll just show off my Klee here real quick. Um, she's not doing the greatest because I've been putting off... Uh, farming artifacts for that long, seriously. Let's talk about crit ratios, guys. Uh, but yeah, let's, let's get started on this. I really would have rather used my um, B team for this because it's a little better at handling situations that are gonna kind of last a while. Klee runs out of stamina really quickly, even with uh, spark charges, and because of that, like, she can really lose steam in a fight, and if it, you know, I, I just ran out of stamina, and uh, now my, the damage output is going to be very re reduced as a result of that. Um, so, does the thing have a health bar? Like, I don't know if I'm doing well or not. And the reinforcement's coming. Uh, Carmilla said that she actually did this in multiplayer and still could not get the win. So, I don't know what to expect, and again, I don't know if I'm winning or not. <laughs> Uh, but I guess if I lose this, then that would mean I could switch to my B team, which is what I wanted to do for this fight anyway. Wait. Huh? Wait, 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 is that it? Hold up. Alright, I'm back. It turns out there's more of this, so we're gonna keep going. I really should have switched to my B team for this. Oh, cool, it's actually giving me the opportunity with which to do so. Let's get started. I, I think this team is just better. No, wait, nope, yeah, nope, not, not ready yet. Sorry, still working on that. Let's, let's change that out. Gonna do a bit of that. Alright, so here's my Noelle, honestly my pride and joy. All members of the Patron Lounge are Noelle appreciators. We did not try to make that happen, it just did. I use a white blind. Most people probably should. Um, I'm not really focusing on crit with this character either, but she still really hits hard for me, so it's okay. Uh, although I am still using a 4 so Look, look, it's been working for me this entire time, okay? <laughs> Let me have this. Game? Game? What, was I not tall enough to activate that? Oh, oh boy. Okay, alright. First off, I don't like this enemy placement. Everything's far away from each other. And these guys seem pretty tanky. I, I definitely had an easier time cutting through their shields uh, earlier. Are there only six enemies, though? This seems like it'd be fine. Let's try to freeze these guys. Okay, that guy- Okay, alright, nope, 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 I see the problem there. I- okay, no, you- you stop that. You stop that. Oh, let me- let me top that guy off. There we go. Now he's dead. Wow, okay, is the problem here really just that these guys were, like, given a ton of HP? Is that it? Is the, is is this like a repeat of the 2 million HP mechanical monstrosity in Abyss Floor 12 right now? Well, I say right now, but that depends on when I edit this video, because I've been really behind on that lately. Okay, and, and my energy gain is a little falling, but... Lord, oh my goodness. I, I, I'd like to get my sweeping time up before the next wi- Okay, game. Alright, I'm just gonna hope that these guys come to me and not towards the thing. Thankfully, they seem to have done exactly that. But, oh my goodness, the hit stun right now is real bad. I hope I didn't already lose my, uh... Okay, good. 
Wow, they actually did a lot of damage to me. That's interesting. That doesn't usually happen. Noel never dies. Alright, just gotta get rid of this last person. Are the Ice Mages also voiced by... Well, I shouldn't say Ice Mages, because the Mirror Maidens and uh, the, the Sissons are different things, right? But anyways, is this lady also voiced by Sucrose? Because, yeah, the Electric Sisson Mage is voiced by Sucrose. Okay, alright. You know what? That actually wasn't too bad. I did have a close call when one of those guys uh, started trying to freeze the defend point instead of trying to freeze me. Uh, but apart from that, that seems okay. Challenge completed, yeah. Uh, alright, where, where, where's the guy? Is that Here he is. Oh, are you really gonna make... <sighs> Okay, so I got on top, and now I gotta go all the way over there, which is all the way over here. And we did the thing! And I got a blueprint to make a stool. Uh, thanks, guys. Right, well, even though this video has gone longer than its uh, intended purpose, just something to cap off this video, I guess. This might help some of you guys. Uh, once you finish this quest, this lady will be here, and uh, here's where she is on the map. You're gonna have to do a bit of climbing to get here. And uh, she'll ask you for three things, and it's a time-gated quest after a time-gated quest. Except it's one of those, like, mini-quests that doesn't actually appear in your quest log. But they're, they're, she'll have quests for you for three days. The first one of them is going to ask you to get a bag of flower seeds, which you can get over here. There will be some stuff on the beach you need to get, and there will be a guy in a hut. And he'll ask you to trade those in, and you can pick one of three chests, but actually it doesn't matter which one you pick. It's based on which, um, what, how many times you've done it before, and then you'll get a bag of flower seeds. She's gonna ask for that for the first day. Annoyingly, the bag of flower seeds, you get it from the second time you've done this. So, yeah, they are getting really obnoxious about this. Um... And you'll get a special achievement for doing her quest three times, but um, that's I, that's that, that's it with the um, the Tatara Tales is uh, defend point. I didn't think it was too bad. I just had a really close call with one of those enemies. Just make sure you draw the attention of the enemies towards you and away from the defend point, and uh, pack some good damage because wow, they're tanky, and you should be fine. <sighs> All right, thanks everyone for watching. I'm Brancliffe. Goodbye, everyone.